SCOBY culture comes ready to brew and it comes in a tightly sealed bag. So make sure when you get it, you open it up right away and get started. So in a glass jar or a plastic container, you're going to prepare your tea by combining hot water and sugar. Then you're gonna add your tea leaves and steep for at least 10 minutes. Let the mixture cool to room temperature, about 72 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit, and remove the tea bags or completely strain the leaves from the liquid. Add the entire package of your live SCOBY with four ounces of the starter tea that comes with it. Cover this with a butter muslin cloth and secure with a rubber band. I just like to use one of the mason jar screw lids. Allow your mixture to sit undisturbed at about 68 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Make sure it's out of direct sunlight for seven to 30 days. Taste every two to three days until your kombucha reaches your desired taste. Pour the kombucha off the top of the jar for consuming and retain SCOBY and enough kombucha from the bottom of the jar to use as starter for the next batch. And if you wanna add carbonation to your kombucha, all you need to do is find one of these bottles with a secure lid and bottle it up for a few days and it will have lots of fizz. No more $5 kombucha at the store. All it takes is just a bit of tea, some hot water, some sugar, your SCOBY, and a little bit of the reserved kombucha and you can make endless kombucha all the time. <laughs> it's that easy.